Begin by printing a status page. Press the System Menu Counter key. Select Report. Press Report Print. Now select Status Page. A screen will present with the following. This will be printed. Are you sure? Status Page. Press Yes. Upon completion, press the Home button to return to the home screen. After printing the status page, look for the IP address here. You'll need it later when installing the Mac driver. To download the latest driver, go to Kyocera Document Solutions.us. Click on Support located near the top of the page. Click on Download Center. In Choose an Option, look for Ecosys M2640 IDW. Look for Mac Driver and click on the Download Arrow key. The download will begin. After downloading the Mac zip file, double-click on the file. You'll now have a folder named Mac. Double-click on the folder. Inside, you'll find one file ending in DMG. Double-click on the file. The file will open up and you will find three additional files. On the left, you will see Kyocera OS Plus file. In the center, the Mac driver guide. And on the right, an uninstaller app. Click on the first file. Go through the wizard. Click Continue, click Continue again, click Continue one more time and agree to the software license to begin the wizard installation. Click on Install. Enter your username and password, click Install Software. Once the installation is complete, you should see a green check mark. Click on Close. You can either keep the installation files or move them to the trash as they are no longer needed. In the System Preferences page, Select Printers and Scanners. Press the plus key and select the IP tab above the printer settings. Type in the IP address for your printer. The IP address is listed on the status page you printed out earlier. Now go to the next line, Protocol, and select Line Printer Daemon LPD. Leave the queue blank and click on Name. Enter a descriptive name of your new printer. Next, click on Location. You can leave this blank or you can name the location of your new printer. Under Use, select Ecosys M2640 IDW KPDL from the pull-down menu. Click Add. Select OK. You may share the printer on the network by clicking on the Sharing Preferences button. You can also make your newly installed Kyocera printer your default printer, meaning any print job from the computer will automatically print to your Kyocera printer. Select the default paper size you'll be using. In most cases, you'll be printing U.S. letter. Go back to the Preferences page and press the red Close button. You've now installed the Kyocera Ecosys M2640 IDW printer.